What's going on, everyone? Darkwater here, back in Tastemaker. Uh, last we left off, we did the outdoor eating area, a nice little patio area for people to come out and enjoy their steak or chicken. They're, you just got a nice steak in. You seem to be very happy with that. Uh, your steak's taking a little bit of time, and your chicken seems to be taking a little bit of time, but that's okay. We're going to do some major expansion here. I let it run. We've got plenty of money. I'm not overly concerned. Um, Again, this is probably going to be the last episode that I do on this. Um, that was weird. Don't know why I had to... Why do I have to keep purchasing this land again? That seems odd. Um, but yeah, I think this is just going to be the last episode I do with this. Probably just kind of build out the restaurant a little bit. Uh, do a little detailing. And uh, just kind of do an overall review on the game. Uh, kind of as we go, uh, I think I am just going to, uh, maybe we'll just expand the patio out. Come down like this, and let's go ahead and get rid of this wall. And we will go ahead and get rid of this wall as well. Uh, bathroom. I'm going to expand out the kitchen. So let's go ahead and build a wall here. Let's add in another couple bathrooms in here. So toilet, toilet, sink, sink. Get a couple doors on there so people can actually get in and use them. One there and uh, one over here. That will suffice. Uh, I think I'm gonna leave the bar as it is. I don't think I'm gonna extend that out anymore. Um, although looking at it, maybe I will just take it just like that, just so it's kind of a, uh, a true kind of, truly looks like a bar. Uh, I do want to extend that wall. So we will extend it all the way over here. Let's go ahead and, uh, I think let's get some decor going. Let's get another couple pictures. Yeah, those four should be fine. Um, I do want to get the fancy table in here. I might rearrange how this is set up. Um, let's see. Because I do want to get the piano in here. So maybe we'll have a little piano bar area and then do the bulk of our seating over on this side. Uh, so let's go ahead and move some tables, chairs, I think. Um, just going to kind of move it off to the side for the time being. You're just going to hang out over here. Uh, let's move these other chairs. Can I move that one? Yes, I can. Okay. Saw the wine glass, didn't know if I could move it at that point or not. Do you want to pick up that plate? That'd be great. Thank you. Table. Let's go ahead and grab the chair and this table as soon as. There we go. I know, fridges are full, that's fine. Because we're going to really expand this here in just a minute. Uh, I'm thinking about putting the piano player right where you're sitting. Excuse me, ma'am, thank you. I, I appreciate you eating a little faster there. Uh, we will take care of that in just a second. I do want to get the piano player in here. Uh, let's go ahead and drop the piano in. Inside of that. Piano again. I don't know why he doesn't look right right there, but we're gonna go ahead and just add him in there. He, he's a grooving though. Uh, do want to get some windows behind him as well. What kind of windows are we using? I feel like this is a new window. Yes, it is. Wow, I, I actually really like that window.
this they've updated this in the last week or so since I last played apparently um, it almost looks like this has lines on it I don't like it there. Uh, let's go ahead and just for symmetry, we'll add in another window there. They changed the staff door as well. Fancy. And then they've got another staff door like that. Got a mail slot, so I don't imagine it's much of an indoor. Um, I do want to go ahead and redo the wallpaper here. Oh, you can shift click that now. I like that. Okay. Uh, I probably will do another wall just to kind of fill out the kitchen area. Um... Yeah, let's take a little bit of time and work on the kitchen real quick. Uh, so I am planning on just opening up the menu entirely. So I think what we're going to do is back here we're going to add a few mixers. We're going to do maybe four, I guess. Three, four... Yeah, let's add five. Because we're doing bread, we're also doing burgers, so going to be quite a lot. Um, let's go ahead and add a bunch of ovens. There we go. Ooh, we might need more storage now that I'm thinking about it. So what if we go ahead and... I was... Try not to put these here, but I think I think we will go ahead and move them up. And then go ahead and move the mixers forward as well. And then we'll go ahead and we will take a wall right through here. We will leave it open on this side. And let's just take this kitchen that way a little bit. People are phasing through the wall there. Um, need at least one more of these. Let's go ahead and get some bowls because we're going to add some soup here. And maybe a few more plates. Um, I think I think I do want to add another fancy staff door there. And we're going to need... Ooh, you need to move over here. There we go. Uh, since we've got all kinds of cash, let's go ahead and just add in a bunch more storage. There we go. Um, do I have you a flower? You know what? We're not going to do flour on this end. We're going to do potatoes, potatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes. Uh, actually, we'll do another tomato there. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Um, okay. So we'll do, you should be potatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes, you are tomatoes. And you are bread, or flour, and all three of you are flour. 
So let's go ahead and grab some ingredients. We're going to get some potatoes. We're going to get some flowers. And some tomatoes. And we're going to go ahead and get another fridge in here. And another fridge in I said another fridge in here. Uh, you are going to be meat only. You are going to be chicken only. You are going to be chicken only. There we go. And need a couple fryers. Um, so we'll go ahead and we'll get one, two, three, four. Need some cutting boards. So one, two, three, four. Five, that'll work. You should not be flour. There we go. Uh, so it looks like we've got enough that we could just add everything to the menu. Burgers, fries, bread, get some pizza in here. Uh, we can actually raise the price up on everything because we are fancy. Uh, go ahead and kind of leave, yeah, we'll leave everything else as it is. Uh, let's run a wall from here to there. Uh, get a fancy staff door back here for the folks in the corner over here. Uh, let's go ahead and take out this section of wall. Henry's complaining there's nothing to do. We will fix that very shortly. Uh, can I delete? Oh, you can change the color. Okay. I uh, don't like the fact that your curtains are limited to that. I don't know. Yeah, I don't think I like that. But we got the piano man here. So he's going to increase the decor quite a bit. Uh, maybe we'll do a fish tank right down here, maybe. Uh, let's see. Time to lay out the... all the tables and chairs. So let's come in here with... I do one, two... No. Maybe I'll do... Do one there. Nice chair. Nice chair. Let's go ahead and do a table for... One and two. There we go. Uh, I think we'll carry that forward. rid of that table or chair. Um, my food arrived late and that makes it a bad restaurant. Okay, that's whatever. We will fix that in just a bit here. move you over and we're going to actually turn you into a fancy table okay we're going to go back in we're going to actually lower the price on pizza a little bit lower burger a little bit lower chicken a little bit steak i don't think we changed anything else really so we'll leave that People are uh, enjoying it at the bar, which is good. Uh, let's come through and start to move tables. One, two, three, and four. And 
it's got a fancy table there and a fancy table there. I'm actually going to extend that wall down to here. Um, right here we're going to extend out. And we're going to do another... No, uh, where's our door? Go ahead and do a staff door there. Again, I kind of, I like this door. I don't think I like that it's got a mail slot. Which makes me wonder, can I put it back here and then when they're dropping food? Excuse you? You can't just come through the staff door and go into the restaurant. Ma'am. What? That is the worst staff door ever. I don't think that's supposed to be a staff door. It's labeled a staff door, but I don't think that's supposed to be a staff door. Okay, well, that's that's that, that's fine, I guess. Sure. Um, confused, but okay. I don't even know where I was going. Hedges are a thing. Fancy. Maybe we'll just do a hedge back here. Edges are nice. Almost as nice as ferns. Almost. Ooh. Get a little cone tree. Can't put it over there, though. Can I put a parasol through a table yet? No. We'll, we'll put a little rock back over here, too. So you can hang out and eat next to nature. Uh... Go ahead, do that there, do that there, that's fine. Walls, good. Uh, bathrooms, we'll go ahead and do those all in blue. Uh, your staff closet, that's fine. Um, I think I'm going to do tile in the kitchen. Yeah, that looks good. Ooh. Should I do stone by the bar? No. I don't like that, actually. Doesn't look as nice as I wanted it to look, but... Um, so yeah, that's one of the issues that I do kind of have with it. Some of this, because I don't think that's recolorable. No. It's just carpet. Ooh. It'd be nice to be able to drag... But, because you could shift click, but it's going to do everything. And that's, I don't want to do the entire outdoor area. Um, but yeah, if I could recolor these a little bit more, that would be nice. Because this is really blue and I'm not a fan. You also can't. Can you rec Oh, you can recolor the tablecloths now. Okay. Huh. And you can recolor the stools. Maybe we do go with the blue? Let's go. Let's go with the blue. Change it up a little. Um, the fact that I'm going to have to do all the chairs individually is a bit annoying. But we're not going to do that. Because I don't think you can recolor here. You have to actually place it and then recolor. There's an arcade machine now. Anyways, vacuums. I was going to do a vacuum in here. I was going to do a second vacuum in here. Um, we're going to hire some more staff. Um, one of the other things that I would like to see changed is a more diverse looking staff. Because everybody looks like Henry here. Um, yeah, but a more diverse staff would be 
nice. Uh, let's pop in here. Being able to assign them to uh, sub duties within, so I can assign Joseph to only cooking steak and chicken, so only using the the stoves, or uh, having good old Charles here only doing the bread making or making burgers. Those kind of things would be also very useful. Uh, one, two, three, four. I think I've got four on each. Oh, I've got more than four on each. Uh, let's go ahead and actually... James is going to serve. John is going to serve. And people collecting dishes, if you could collect more than one at a time, it would be nice. Oh, we got more staff now. Uh, kind of thinking. Maybe over here we look at getting the fish tank in. But we'll come to that in just a minute. I want to get the rest of these tables in. these chairs in here and we'll get us another four more tables and ooh, let's get some music going in here in the corner Grooving very nicely. Ooh, put the statue out in the out here on the patio. And fish tank. I am still thinking about doing the fish tank over here, but maybe we will put it over here because it actually fits fairly evenly there. Um. Ooh, did not mean to do that. So let's go ahead and come in here, we'll continue our table shenanigans. Ooh, we are out of money. Alright, issues, decorations great, could use some extra toilets, took hours for my food. Uh, hours for my food. With as many staff as we have. Um, you know, let's take the prices down a little bit. Let's start to kind of really deal in volume here. Because we got plenty of people here. Our decor is outstanding right now. Menu is amazing. Restaurant is amazing. Let's take a look at our stats. Price is still an issue. Uh, wait time is all over the place. Uh, we are losing money. That's to be expected. And Dave is really complaining about a workload issue here. David, what are you doing? David, I assume, is the only David we have is cooking. So let's get you another cook. How's that? Does that make you happier, David? Actually, let's turn Robert into a server as well. Gives us three people collecting dishes, which I think we'll be okay with. Good restaurant, decoration is good. Okay with that. 
Well, we are starting to fill up everywhere, which is great news. Uh, I could probably actually come in here and start to ratchet down how much ingredients we're getting. So we're very stocked up on everything. Oh, I haven't noticed if they come in through the side door. No, they don't. They just come in through the front door still to do deliveries. Well, it was a thought. Figured it'd be a little bit faster for them to just come through the, the side door directly into the kitchen. Well, we got a decent amount of people in here. Uh, extra toilets, took hours for my food, food arrived late. So let's get a couple more servers in here. So promote Michael to serving, James to serving, John to serving, and actually we're going to come up here and Max and Henry are going to get into the kitchen as well. I know it's probably annoying for me to keep adjusting these, but it makes it easier so I can see how many uh, I have staff-wise. Um, being able to sort these, I think, would be a nice touch, because then I could see exactly how many uh, people we have. Um, at any given time, we've got a, a rat running around, so we might actually need a, another person to help clean, because uh, we do have the ability to, to deal with that right now, so let's go ahead and uh, add one, there we go. Um, I need another dishwasher, in all honesty. Oh, no, they're processing them fast. That's not a big deal. But we do have quite a lot of people in our restaurant. Uh, the decor is good. Uh, again, I do like the fact that you can uh, recolor tables, chairs. It would be nice if you could maybe... Yeah, it doesn't look like you could shift-click them. Or if you could do like a, a control click to select multiples and be able to color multiples at a time. Um, just because recoloring all of this would just take a significant amount of time. Um, I think some more patterns for the wallpaper, more patterns for the carpet. Even doing recoloration for the carpet would be nice. Um... Because right now the only carpet colors you've got are the carpet, the red carpet, and then these blue tiles. Um, but I do like the, the stone. And even the, the tiles for the kitchen are, are pretty nice as well. Um, but again, this is early access, so there's... Plenty of room for improvement. Um, did not recolor this other side of the wall. <laughs> uh, made 104 last month. That's that's good. Price is still kind of meh. So you know what? Let's let's go ahead and. Reduce that down a little bit. We're going to lower prices on everything by three coin. We're just going to cram a bunch of people in here. 
and hopefully that'll take care of some of the pricing issues and we'll just have a, a nice busy restaurant maybe get some people eating out here on the patio as well have an influx of people coming in right now got some people hanging out on the, the nice patio Waiting time is starting to decrease. And David's back to complaining about the workload. That is still the only David I have, correct? No, I do have a second David. Again, default having multiple uh, larger database of names would be nice. It looks like serving is an issue as well. So, you know what? Let's go ahead and hire another couple servers. I can't place that there. And by that, you mean my employee. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and hire one of each. Also, I feel like they don't pay too much attention to cleaning the bathrooms. And again, that would be a nice sub-job to have somebody just go through clean bathrooms occasionally. Um, okay, well, let's go ahead and hire another couple people here. And tomatoes. Let's lower the amount of tomatoes we're getting in here. As well as potatoes. Apparently fries are not selling right now. However, apparently flour's a thing. Uh, chicken meat and wine I think we're holding steady at. It's just kind of Equalizing the other ones, especially after we uh, adjusted the pricing on everything. But yeah, I have really enjoyed the game. Uh, just small operational tweaks I think would be nice. Um, again, I don't imagine you would ever need this much staff. And that's why I think having specific line cooks doing specific jobs again only doing oven work only doing stove work only dealing with the fryers having somebody in the back only handling washing the dishes somebody collecting the dishes so just being able to assign your staff to specific jobs would be would be very nice um some of the recolorability and adding a little, a few more textures would be very nice as well. And a lot more diversity with the the characters, especially the especially the staff, um, would be would be something that I would really like as well. Um, because even just using the models you have now, you could easily uh, take this bald guy here and convert him into one of the staff. Um, but yeah, it's, I really enjoy it. The challenges were great. Um, really makes you think as to how you're going to try and lay things out and really how you're going to push what food you're, you're really selling. Wait time's still really low. Huh? But yeah, I've, I've had a, a good time. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the series as well. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and leave this here. We'll let it sit and uh we'll see what new things the developers come out with if we get some new scenarios i'll definitely uh, add those back onto the channel um but yeah i appreciate you guys for watching uh if you haven't already you know like uh 
these creative type games and management games. I really enjoy them myself, so go ahead and uh, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And as always, I look forward to seeing you guys again. And as always, I hope you guys have yourselves a spectacular day. Oh, yeah.